Hello friends and welcome back to Seven Days to Die with your host Rongo the Bold. This is season two. We are on day two, kind of the end of day two. We've just found this nice uh, prefab. I'm kind of clearing the area out here. We're going to need to find a place to, to hold up for tonight. So in the meantime, I'm just I'm just kind of killing everybody because they need killing. Zombies need killing. And unfortunately, I haven't had a chance to loot too many of them because it's been literally just non-stop zombies. Okay, and do a quick bit of crafting downing. Uh, I'm holding on to my cans as is because right now I do not have um, a pot yet. Oh, I can't craft those down to scrap iron? Oh, thought you could. Um, so we are going to spend the night in one of these really quick, nice, nearby houses, probably that one right there. I would like to uh, do a little more exploring, but it's getting late. So I want to go ahead and we're going to clear out this building here. I think that's a good, it's a good pick for the night. I'll, go I'll grab this guy and no, I don't want to grab that guy yet. Iron Reinforced Club. Craft it down. Oh, hello. Again, the loot settings are pretty pretty stingy. So it is hard for me to find all the all the good gear I need to find. I'm really hoping to find an axe and screw you, Rongo. Brass, 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 brass. Early in the game, it's always good to go ahead and start saving up some brass because you're going to end up using a lot of it later on to make your bullets. Alright, I guess we gotta... Of course every door is locked. Why wouldn't they be, right? We're gonna probably go ahead and just camp out on the roof tonight. And then what I may do tomorrow is tomorrow we'll just loot in the area um, so that we get a little bit of supplies get, get a little more organized and uh, hopefully find that um, crafting book for the forges come on come on come on you can break I know you can break there we go Now the question is, oh yes, we do have zombies inside. The question is, we had zombies inside. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put some frames out. Just kind of lock this place down a little bit. I'll put two layers, just because I'm paranoid. And, okay, let's go ahead and check what we got going on in here. We got Bob. Hey, Bob. I didn't even see those. That's weird. <laughs> so all of these metal shelves can be broken down for scrap metal as well, which can be very nice. What do we got back here? Oh, <gasps> yes. Here's the question. Is it fast to go through the door or to go through two chunks of, conc of brick? Uh, how many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Roll pop? I don't know. Quit asking me hard questions. Hope you guys are liking this uh, new season so far. I'm um, going to try and make it last a little bit longer than the last one. Just check this. All right. I um, want to really build things up nice. And like I mentioned way back, I want you guys to kind of decide what type of base I build. I know where I want to build in the plains biome. But I want you guys to kind of decide whether I should go for an open plains biome with a big wall around it or go for a uh, mountaintop kind of thing with a big frontal wall. And uh, really, you gave me this kind of crap. Uh, it's not even worth it at this point to have the shotgun. So I was hoping for a full gun. That would have been, that would have been much better. 
I'm gonna leave the tungsten trophy for now as well. I'm I've got a long way to go before I can use tungsten. All right, let's see what we got going on up here. I'm gonna take this bottom rung out. Always take the bot. Always take the bottom rung out of ladders because zombies um, can't jump up and get the second rung, so they won't come up after you. So if you're going to spend the night on a roof, get rid of that bottom rung. Choppy chop. Come on. My little poor little axe is about ready to bust. I've got another one I made earlier. The higher durability your weapon has, the more damage it does. So you generally want to keep your weapons in good shape. Repair them often. Each weapon takes a different item to repair. Like these take rocks to repair, but it's actually cheaper to just break it than to repair it, I think. So, oh yes. I have enough bullets to kill myself with now. Oh, it's the moment of truth. Reloading weekly. Okay, I'll take that. Really. Thank you so much for the books that I really can't use. Uh, pro tips. You can bust these sofas up and they turn into cloth. Or they used to turn into cloth. Drapes, however, definitely turn into cloth. These guys used to turn into cloth. I could swear they used to turn into cloth. No, oh, now they just chip away. Okay. Um, grabbing that. These beds function as a bedroll as well, so you can pick those up if you want something a little fancier to wear or to sleep on. Oh yeah, rocking it. And I decided this in this in this in this game I'm going to do this once in a while. Oh yeah, pimped out. Good-looking guy, isn't he? Looks just like me. Sort of not really. Maybe not ever. Okay, so what else we got in here? Kitchen area, excellent. I'll take bandages. Uh, another pro tip, break, op break open these toilets. Actually, I'm going to leave that toilet alone because that toilet is my drinking water source. I know, disgusting, right? Uh, and when you bust them down, you will get a short metal pipe out of them, pretty much consistently. All right. We found this place in perfect time. Really, nothing? Come on. One pot. All I ask for is one freaking pot. All right, let's uh, we'll turn this brass trophy. Oops into brass I need because you we, because we can't forge it is really a pain I'm gonna combine these two to make one uh, it's really a pain to bust uh, sorry what am I trying to say because we can't forge we can't make a pot by ourselves we gotta find one which is rather inconvenient rather inconvenient I did check this, right? Yep. All right, let's go ahead and check, check up on the roof. Oh, look. You see, wouldn't it be awesome if that was a note that said, uh, you know, I was here and I died and I'm really sorry. I left my wife behind and blah, 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 blah. You know, just some cool little story. It'd be kind of nice. What else we got up here? All of these ductwork can be broken up. Also really good for uh, metal. And these air conditioners almost always have short metal pipes in them as well. And they can also be busted up into scrap metal. But seeing as how we don't have a forge... I wonder how many, how many days it's going to take. Any bets, anyone? Alright, I'm going to go ahead and put my sleeping bag down because... You never know. Oh, that's right. These are half height blocks, and you actually can put your sleeping bag down, but it's 
a levitating sleeping bag. Because the block voxel is actually, you know, all the way up, so. Um, okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and do a jump cut to morning at this point because there is uh, nothing that you guys are going to see for the next two hours. Um, actually, I will, before I do that, I'm going to make a campfire and I'm going to show you guys how to boil water. So we'll craft this and I'll put that down here. I'm going to go with one of our empty cans. And I know it just got really dark. I went over to the toilet, I right clicked, and I filled up my can. And then I'm going to take a stick. So we'll get a craft. Get a craft a plank down to a sticks. Now, um, I did read a little bit about the heat map. And when you're using your forges and your campfires to cook things or, or smelt things, the way the heat map works is it's a roughly 2% increment per fuel item added to the fire. It's what gets added to the heat map. So when you're cooking things, it's, for example, better to use one lump of coal than to use 10 lumps of you know, broken down coal. Or it's better to use a whole log rather than planks because your heat map will actually go up based on the number of items put in. At least that's the way it seems to be working. So just kind of keep that in mind. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put a whole log on here. Let it cook for a while. I'll put a stick in here. So with the stick you could char meat like rabbit or pig or whatever. And you can now also take your can of murky water, drop it in there and cook and it'll start cooking. Now I'm going to go ahead also and run back and I'm going to fill up another can because I'm, I'm a thirsty boy. Now these do not stack so you can't um, you know, put a whole bunch of empty, empty cans in your inventory. And the thought behind that is these are cans so they had no lid so why would, they, why would you be able to you know, do anything with them? So I'm going to drink that. Perfect. You do get the can back. So I'm going to go ahead over here one more time. I'm going to do this for a few minutes just to get my hydration back into gear. But I'm going to go ahead and do the jump cut now, and I will see you guys in the morning. Uh, so the night was really quiet, uneventful, nothing happened. Went ahead and boiled up some more water. Uh, just so you know, you can stack multiple cans um, uh, into the input queue and output queue, but you can only pick up the one can. So... Uh, you can't stack multiple in your inventory, however, so just to keep that in mind. Uh, I wanted to go ahead and also, I went ahead and crafted some, I'm going to put this bullet down for a second just so I have space. I went ahead and crafted up um, some armor. I'll go ahead and drop this on myself. Boots, skull, see now we're getting, getting a little defended at least. So we're up to 12s. Not quite as good as my scrap metal armor I had, but we will have it again. Oh yes, we will have it again. So we've got some water to drink, which is going to be nice. Uh, leave the campfire there. Pick up our sleeping bag. Actually, you know what? I'm going to leave the sleeping bag down for right now. Just in case um, we have a, a situation. So I'm going to go ahead. Now we're going to go out, and I want to check out these other um, locations that happen to be here. So we are, let's look at our map. We're, we're in this one here. So let's go, we'll go clockwise around these. That way we have a, that way we have a plan, a plan of attack. Like I said, it was a really quiet night. I uh, just cooked that water up and uh, now I am ready to stab some zombies. Oh, hello! He's like, what? You want to stab me? Uh-huh. Well, yes, I do. Don't get yourself pinned like I just did. That was a bad decision. Um, nails! Okay, I th thought I heard a dog. 
seems like there's a lot of zombies out this morning. Okay, yes, there is a dog. He must be locked inside that house. Okay, last night it was uh, nurses. Tonight it's uh, it's creepy lurch guy. I wonder. <coughs> pardon me. I wonder if they're going to add um, now that they've got the UMA system working, uh, the Unity Malware Asset or whatever it's called that lets you make the uh, make your cool cut character customizations. I wonder now if they have that, if they're going to add that uh, to the zombies so that the zombies have some ver some variety. That would be kind of cool. Oh god, here we go. Uh, let's, let's, stay, let's stay with club. Uh, hello. Hello, that was not, not friendly of me, of you, of any of us. Um, what I've seen is I'm going to keep the club ready because at close quarters uh, with the dog, I'd rather be I'd rather have the club than try and reload. Okay, I'm gonna just check these real quick. Urban and pistol, we already have. Okay, I'm just gonna do this real quick. Learn the thing you can while you can learn them. And as soon as those pills are free, I'm going to uh, chug another pill. Okay, where is this zombie? Okay, it sounds like they're actually next door. Next door or above me, one of the two. Now, I think we're gonna test this right now. I think these green walls have, yeah, these are, these are still the easy ones. So they're slowly replacing all the blocks with the kind of upgraded ones that are frames uh, that have to be upgraded. So right now, the green walls, it's easier to go through than it is to, um, I don't need either, did I just pick up both that crap? No, I didn't want either of that. The glass panes you can melt down for glasses, but it's actually much easier just to use um, sand. So they've got to be in the roof. Water, thankfully, yes. No, oh, this is not going to be good, is it? That ah, toilet back there. <sighs> okay, guys. Wish me luck. Oh. Alright, well, I'm going to put a frame over that so they don't come after me. Okay, let's see what we got in here for us. Maybe we got a uh, safe. All I really care about right now is a bookcase with ye old 4G manual A. Come on. Here I know definitely these, these walls are made of the new reinforced. Is that I believe? Tungsten, yeah. Really? You put a protective barrier over a couple piles of trash. Priorities, man. Priorities. Um... Well, let's do this. Plank, to sticks, and then three more of these. Oop. And bolt, and crossbow. There's definitely been a behavior change. Um, at least it appears that there has been a behavior change in how um, crafting works. So it used to be you could, if you had an item on there and you shift clicked it, it would actually apply it. So some, there's a, some small change there. Um, so now I can't pick up those sticks. Or actually, let me just, I'll do this. 
drop off, pick up my sticks, bolt me up, baby. Alright, I picked that up. Okay, so sounds like those zombies have quieted down. Oh, so nest over here because, because nests. So this roof was really just a waste. This whole house was a waste. Punks? Alright, well, next little missile, please. Except I do want to check Bob. Alright, let's, um, let's go through here. And again, with these green walls, it's easy to go through. Because those uh, wood planks, I think, take more than 10 hits. Okay, come on. Nice. Pot, pot, pot. Come on. Pot, pot, pot. I'll go ahead and, I'll go ahead and eat that right now. That reminds me to eat my pain pills. The hydration hit, I wish I didn't have to take, but... Come on. What's that for? I think the repair tool, definitely. Ah. Leg armor, honey armor. I'll take that just for the... Just for the metal. Alright, so this house was kind of a bust. Alright, so that was... We had like eight... I think eight hits. Let's try this. One, two, three, seventeen... 18. <laughs> okay, so it is still better to go through the walls. Um, I was just going to double check, but yeah, walls are still faster for the green walls. So far, that's the only texture that has that issue. So we're going to go, yep, straight across here. Oh, what the hell is chasing after me? Guys up there somewhere. It's okay, folks. It's okay. I'm just here to check your meters. Okay, let's put frames down. I'm not sure if this is the same exact, but very. Oh, it's a different layout than the other house. So I think this house has... Oh, nice. I think this house has a uh, safe in it. The first thing I'm going to do... Where are they? That sounded really freaking close, didn't it? Okay. I'm gonna have to deal with the situation, am I not? So here's what I suggest I'm gonna do. Don't worry that one window goes out easy and the other ones don't, but because the top one watch this. Yeah. Hey, guess what, Fido? I'm gonna kill you from the safety of my ledge, provided I don't fall to my death. Is that on the roof? You know what I'm going to do, just because. Yeah, I thought so. Screw you, Fido. Oh, he would have been a surprise. How the hell did you get up here anyway, here, buddy? 
Oh, this is my who's your friend? Can I hit him with my You going ape shit, buddy? Here, let me back up a little bit. Let me see you see if it'll slow down a little bit. Okay, yeah. I'll just shoot him with my crossbow. Since he doesn't mind being shot in the ass. Yeah, those things are freaking creepy. He would have been a surprise had I uh, just done what I was going to do and come up that ladder. All right. Come on, nursey nurse. These things like circle like sharks. When you're aimed in, you can't pick stuff up. So just keep that as an awareness. Okay. Yeah, I can't hit those guys from there, so I'm not going to worry about it for now. But I am going to do this. Just on the off chance that they come come a knock in. Oops. So again, green wall, way easy. Three. Way easier than going through the um, wood planks, especially when there's two of those. Be here for hours. Bullets, I'll take. Uh, how do I want to do this? Okay. Um, let's go ahead and. Eat some food. And we'll drink some drink. And what I want to... Do I... Yeah, I have that Reloading Weekly book, which lets me um, take apart um, ammo. So what I want to show you was... Mirai, brass is really one of the tight parts of the game. Shell casings is tough. So you can grab your bullets and you put them in your didn't I have reloading weekly I could have swore I had reloading weekly well uh, basically what I was gonna do is put it in my output queue break the bullet up into pieces just grab the shell casings drop them over there so I don't need the, the 7.62s as much as I need the um, the uh, 9 mil right now leather tank I'll take that See with 10 millimeter, I had no need for 10 mil, but if I if I had my reloading weekly book, I could break them down. So I'll keep in mind that we've got bullets here, um, and if I come back later, uh, if I find a reloading weekly in this town, then I will check that. Okay, let's check this trash can. Man, we got some friends out there. The sad part is we 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 got to go out there still. Alright, so let's go ahead carefully. Cloth here as well. If you need cloth, all those break into cloth fragments. Which I don't really need. Other than I can make some whoops, uh here and here. Nope. Here and here. Cloth gloves, yep, there we go. So I haven't crafted cloth gloves yet. And put them on our character. Oh, I guess I did put make cloth gloves. What did I not make? Oh, a hat. All right, let's make a hat. Get rid of the gloves. Thank you much, but no thank you. Cloth fragment, yes. Okay, so hat. Um, I think it's just cloth. Cloth head armor is what it's called. Didn't I have four of them? Guys, am I going nuts? Am I going insane? Am I losing my mind? You can tell me later. Nice little hood. There we go. What do I look like now? 
Looks like some sort of really freaky, yeah, day glow kind of shirt going on too. All right, so let's go down again. Finish looting this place up. Don't need nails. Come on, man. Is it so hard to give me just one little cooking pot? It's all I want for. All I ask for. It might take us two days to clear this town out. I am not moving very quick. In these short days I've got the game set on, 30 minute days with 35% night, um, makes the time go by pretty darn quick. Alright, let's loot this up. Uh, I don't really need those, but I'm taking them anyway because I'm insane. What did I just do? I picked up, yes. Of course I picked up the card, couch arm. Because I'm insane. Ammunition, leather tanning, home maintenance. Home maintenance will take. Make that repair tool. Thank you much. Ammunition nation. I, I'm pretty sure we... Okay, now we can do that bullets trick. Hello, Tammy, we definitely already got... Uh. Ah! Stop clicking things. Urban combat for shotguns. Oh, we already have that. Hunting knife. Give that a shot. And home maintenance, just home maintenance again. So, alright, well, you know. I guess can't be choosers. But I will go ahead. We'll head back upstairs and we'll grab those bullets oh they're over here okay so bullets again once again we're gonna do here grab the shells and grab the shells or the casings for me right now they're much more valuable you know lead you can mine by the buttload uh, but not so, not so the other stuff. So always better to keep what you can actually find. Uh, let's see what we can see. Uh, cardboard boxes, the loot's been really crappy on those, so I'm not going to worry about them. And we will go out the back door. See you, bitches. Okay, uh, yep, north now. So this little, whatever this is house, Rongo. That's a house. Who's hunting me? Maybe it's off these guys. It seems like we don't have that many afters right now, so. I need to repair my club soon. Well, I'll take it for now. So that's the house we were staying in. And more of that back doors need to be unlocked. Um, okay, we have enough rocks to repair it. So the stone axe, you can see the durability is 99 out of 250, so I need, I need um, 150 healing basically, and the rock does 30, so I need five stones. And my pickaxe gets all rebuilt. Now it's all special. It's very smashy. Hulk smash! All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode here again. Actually, let's look, let's look at the kitchen. I want you guys to see if we happen to find the precious, precious cooking pot. I'll go ahead and eat that. And being the smart people we are. Yeah, that's good enough. Oh, come on. Like every town, every 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 uh, house in America has like seven million cooking pots. Or every every house in the world has seven million cooking pots, and we get the one without any.
I'll take those pain pills for a dollar. Two deaths still. Still doing good there. Alright. I'll finish the house, let you guys see that, and then we'll call it an episode. How's that sound? Alright, you guys talked me into it. Just one little bit more looting. Ooh, this is the house with the... I think this is the house with the safe up front. Fingers crushed. I can't believe we've got Reloading Weekly, Leather Tanning, Home Maintenance, Ammunition Nation, Hunting Knife, and we still don't have the supposedly very common um, Forge Book. That makes me sad. Two more bookcases. Two more chances of having our hopes dashed. This is a sad, sad thing. Do, 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 do. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Building weekly. Really. 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 Just to be certain that I actually did have this already. Yep. Oh. Well, with that disappointing turn of events, I will call this an episode. We will pick back up in the morning. I'm going to go back and hide in our little house. Um, it's getting kind of late. I need to get things uh, tidied up a little bit. And then we're going to, tomorrow, hunt the other block. And hopefully, hopey, hopey, hopefully, we will find a cooking pot or the forge book. I'll take either one at this point. So that's our house. So we have one, two, if you count that, and that. So we have two buildings and and that little, uh, whatever that is, uh, shed that we can still loot. So not a lot left in this town. And we're already at day three. So, yeah, folks, this could be a mite scary. I'm going to go ahead and put a double double reinforcer there. And I'll put a uh, another set here. And I'm going to go ahead and do a little bit of crafting down, um, organizing, make sure that I've got everything I was supposed to have lined up. And I will see you guys in the next episode. I hope you're enjoying. If you are, click that like button. Leave me a comment. I love the comments. Keep them coming. And uh, tell your friends, family, and your grandmother.